and welcome back to Good Morning Sri Lanka with me, Vasami Smile on MTV Sports. And just before the break, if you did, if you were uh, tuned in, you would have noticed that I was talking to a few interesting guests uh, from the management and student committee of CIM Sri Lanka. And of course, right now we're going to talk to them a little further on about this event. Uh, which is going to take place on the 26th of March, which is the Future Marketers Conference, which they call the next big uh, thing. Guys, if you can just recap on what the event is about and let's just discuss it further. Yeah, it's basically, as the name suggests, it's the next big thing. Mm -hmm. It's about digitization. Because what we named it next big thing is currently in Sri Lanka, we quite we have to accept that we lack digitization. I think use of social media and even the companies doesn't do mm. use uh, social media for the marketing activities so that's why we named it because there's something uh, beyond uh, Facebook and Twitter yeah so actually that's why our target is because when it says so the digitalization people think of uh, only social media aspect I mean there's something beyond that so that's why we need to bring an insight of uh, the digitalization I see. Also on the same topic, I mean it's very interesting to note that the theme for this year is digitization and digital uh, marketing, marketing. Uh, in, in, in that perspective, especially as you see Sri Lanka is an evolving market when it comes to internet users and I think the last reported figures were about 2 to 2 million, 2, 2 to 2.5 million internet uh, users which was uh, actually reported by the TRC. Mm -hmm. And also uh, if I'm not mistaken in Sri Lanka we have just uh, below 2 million uh, Facebook users mm -hmm. and um, also when it comes to companies we see every day that okay slowly slowly people are now coming into social media mm -hmm. and they're starting to get the hang of it and also you see the involvement of different uh, specialized agencies that take care of yeah. social media yeah. and I'm thinking uh, Keith social media is one of the key aspects uh, that uh, you will be talking about in uh, this uh, conference Yes, uh, social media, it's not limited to social yeah. media, it's uh, digitization of uh, uh, practically everything. Anybody with an online presence, uh, website, or company, uh, company individual, with a Facebook presence, Twitter, or online, it's anybody uh, who has the online presence would uh, find this u yeah. conference useful to them and uh, their attendance would be uh, quite useful because uh, I m to talk more about the overall uh, structure of the uh, program, I would like to ask Lalaka to brief you on the speakers that are going to be attending this event as well as the panel panel that's going to be yes, there. Yes, Lalaka, if you can just tell us about the speakers that are attending yeah. the event. Yeah. I'm sure especially for digital medium, you will get different specialized aspects that will cover the entire mm -hmm. medium and you would have speakers that will talk about yeah. the different avenues. So if you can just tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, we have a very interesting panel this year. Four speakers, four main speakers. Uh, Mr. Madhu Ratnayaga. The senior vice president and general manager of Virtusar Corporation to be basically talking about ecosystem companies how digitization would affect uh, companies ecosystem then next one is uh, Mr. Rohan Jaivira he's the country consultant of Google Sri Lanka he'll be talking about face as uh, Sukhita said digitization beyond Facebook mm. and Twitter that's one, one of the topics then uh, Dr. Peter Lovelock he's uh, is a director of TPS, TRPC Singapore and a consultant of Pepper Group Sri Lanka. He'll be talking, he's, he's a researcher by, by profession. He'll be talking of uh, how the consumer behavior, how the change of the consumer behavior through digitization. Then, uh, last topic, so rather, last speaker is the Mr. Wellington Perra, he's a director representing Microsoft. He'll be talking about innovation around the transition. I see. And this uh, event, guys, uh, where will it be taking place? Uh, this will be at uh, Hotel Galadari and uh, we are planning to start by 8 a.m. 8 a.m. We will go till uh, 4.30, followed by uh, breakfast, lunch and evening snack. I see. So in case uh, somebody wants to um, come and join this conference, how would they find themselves? Actually, we them? have uh, sent our flyers, e-flyers to all the institutes. Mm -hmm. And people who are registered at a CIM office. Uh, yeah, you can you can yeah. get tickets from CIM, CIM office, office, which is in Deal Place, Columbia Three, and all the, the institutes. Mm. We have five institutes in Sri Lanka. All the institutes. Just give us a call. We'll yeah. And uh, how many participants are you expecting for the event? Well, well last year we had around 300 plus okay. participants. So, so we are yeah. expecting the same crowd because uh, due to the success of the last, last year. year 
we that's why we wanted to have it this year also i see i see and uh, what is your target audience like for the event uh, basically basically students and professionals the uh, starting level professionals yeah because we are not only expecting the marketing crowd because that's why we want to talk about digitalization that's relevant to any everybody yeah so we are planning to have like you know also yeah, any man unit any any yeah. any i see so um anything else you want to elaborate on in terms of the event which you think our viewers would find uh, useful kit yeah i think basically come and get your tickets early it's uh, <laughs> yeah, the yeah, 20 it's deal place uh, Kala, deal place a colombo 3 okay and uh, the telephone number lalaka is uh, 9125648608 and if you could just repeat that again lalaka 9125648608 Eight six zero. So there you go. Uh, we were just talking about the next big thing, which is the future uh, marketers conference, which is on the twenty sixth of March at uh, Galadari. And as these fine gentlemen just mentioned, it starts from eight a.m. right till four p.m. And you will also be getting breakfast and lunch, <laughs> if I'm not mistaken. That's yeah. that is what you said. Yep. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right. And uh, if you wanna contact. uh these guys you can just call them on 0112 uh, 5648608 which i believe is the number of the cim office yes, yes. Right. and if you can uh, just call 0112 5648860 and you can find out on how you can get your tickets or you can just walk in uh, to the cim office which is at number 20 deal place a colombo 3 number 20 deal place a colombo 3 uh, uh, which is for the event on the 26th of march Of course thanks very much for educating us on this event I'm sure you will have a uh great turnout at the event but just before uh, we wrap up i just want to tell our viewers a few stories of which we uh, have lined up um sugary drinks linked to 180,000 deaths worldwide now sugar sweetened beverages are linked to more than 180,000 obesity related deaths a worldwide each year according to a new research presented this week at an american heart association uh, conference now this means about one in every 100 deaths uh, from obesity related diseases is caused by drinking sugary uh, beverages uh, says study author gitanjali singh uh, post doctoral research fellow at the Harvard School of Public Health and among the world's 35 largest countries Mexico had the highest death rates from sugary drinks and Bangladesh had the lowest according to the study uh, with the United States ranked uh, third so that's just a little interesting story which I thought uh, that I will uh, bring to you what do you think of that story kid I think it's a good story. <laughs> <laughs> also, I, I, to make I up mean, the time. <laughs> being at the time, I mean, obesity has been actually a big issue that has been mm, going yes. around in the media, and of course, yeah. I'm sure a topic like this would be uh, discussed at uh, marketing forums as well. Especially, I believe at CIM, you get a little subject called emerging themes. Yeah. Yep. And yes. Uh, yes, and true. I've been known. I know a few colleagues who actually use obesity as a topic. Uh, as an yeah, emerging assignments. team, yeah. which would kind of uh, yeah. see Silo how it would just. relate to their um, organization or industry, rather. Yes. So, nice. so Wasam, I believe you are also uh, uh, <laughs> a student of CIM. Okay, I was actually hoping that you would not <laughs> mention that on air, kid. <laughs> But yes, um, so you could uh, attend the yeah. conference on the twenty sixth as well. Yeah. Okay, all right. Yeah, Rant is out of the you. cage. <laughs> <laughs> well yes I I happen to be a student of CIM myself definitely I will be looking forward to attend the event uh, right. which is on the 26th of March um also um don't forget we've got the Kingswood and Dharmaraja match coming up uh, which is on the 30th of March so in case you don't attend uh the match you can always watch it live on MTV Sports and that being said it's kind of, we have to wrap up now as we are get coming getting out of time so thank you very much Keith for thank being on the show thank, thank you very you much Lalaka thank, 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 thank you very much for your time and i sincerely hope that the uh, conference is successful on the 26th so thank you thank for you. being here thank on the you. studio this thank morning we see you there thank and uh, you are watching good morning sri lanka and we will be back on monday thank you